so I'm at, where am I? <laughs> the Vegan Gringo in Santa Barbara. It's my first stop because honestly I was like so excited about it. So I got the um, chipotle crema, the chicken, the rice and beans, the jalapeno, and uh, the gallo. Let's try it. That's amazing. Oh my god. I have to work on that. It's really good. It's just like watery. But it's really good. Oh, yes. <laughs> Can we have like a real moment for a second? So. I'm doing this alone, like I've mentioned a thousand times, and I knew this was going to be a struggle, but it's already a struggle, and that is food. One, I wish that I had someone to bring along to eat with me and share, and I can show you guys more food. And two, I can never finish my food, and I hate wasting food, so I love giving it to whoever I'm with. I tried. Sorry. <laughs> I really tried to finish this, and like I'm sick to the point where like I'm like exploding. So, yeah. Maybe I can like, save it, and then pick up later, but then I would be hungry to show you more food later, you know? Just start off. Anyway, I'm glad I'm going to do next. We'll figure it out. Bye! Verde, and I'm thinking of doing this the gluten free macadamia butter crostini, and then baklava. I think I'll be good on that. I don't think I need like a main thing. So, this is the bummer about like, being alone is that I can't get I can't show you as many things, but you know, I, I'll get more food, <laughs> I'll come back here for sure. Ah, so here's the crustini. Clearly blackberries. There's the yogurt. And um, it looks super good. So I feel like everyone wants to see it. It is like warm and dense and thick. Let's zoom in on this guy, not my face. Yes, 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 lovely. It tastes like an adult peanut butter and jelly. I'm into it. I just wanted to show you the dessert menu. It might change, but yeah, I'm so stoked. Um, uh, obviously that has honey, so no. Um, I always love chocolate cake, but eh. And I don't even know what that really is, but that does sound good. But we're going baklava. <laughs> it's here, the baklava! Okay, so let's just zoom in really quick if it will focus on this beauty. Okay, so look at this flakiness. Oh, it's perfect. I'm excited. Does anyone else get this stoked about food? Like, I feel like I didn't get this stoked until I turned vegan, and now, like, everything is amazing to me. <laughs> so, I will eat it now. So, the ice cream has pistachio on it. Um, I don't even know. Okay, let's just eat the ice cream first. Why is that like so much better than like any other vegan ice cream I've ever had? Okay. I'm just going to like pick up the box and it's just like falling apart. Yeah. My faces are really misleading. It's really good. 
但係起身眼白牌，起身個房頂，我好 super excited。I think just like what's inside isn't like traditional box color, but the flakiness is like literally so good. Super special, but I'm definitely getting the sausage and onion flatbread. Um, yeah, I wish you guys could actually see the menu. That would be cool. And then I also ordered the Artemis brew, which again, wish you could actually see. Um, but I'm not getting it with honey. So this is the Artemis brew without honey, and yeah. I forgot, I should actually show myself drinking it. It's like tea. It's like really good tea. Um, yeah, I hate drinking hot stuff. Okay, does anyone else do this where they ask the waitress what their favorite is on the menu and then they tell you and then you're like I'm not gonna get that <laughs> like you're like uh, I'm gonna go with this and then you feel guilty you're like oh, did I just like make them tell me their favorite and then I don't even get it and now they think they have bad taste like I'm like I'm like what do you like because I'm not getting that <laughs> so just me I feel bad when I do that, but I do it every time, like, every time I'm like, what's your favorite? And they pick out something on the menu that I wasn't even thinking of, and I'm like, sweet potato, I don't like sweet potato. So, that's out. <laughs> I'm weird. I'm not weird, that's normal, right? Everyone, everyone thinks that way. Yeah, let me know. Oh my gosh, yes. <laughs> This is the sausage and onion pizza with macadamia ricotta. Like, uh, I'm so excited. Yay. And because everyone likes to see me eat. I hope everyone likes seeing me burn myself as well. Basically twice. Once on the key and once on this. <laughs> 
No, it's actually like amazing. Like, I don't know what the sauce is made out of, but it's like, it's awesome. Okay, I lied. And do you know what the sauce is made out of? It's made out of wheat berry. Um, so I don't know if there's like gluten free like version of this. Probably not. I'm gonna try the ricotta now. It tastes like a slightly sweeter ricotta, but really spot on. Like pretty spot on, except slightly sweet. Probably because of macadamia. <laughs> this is the chocolate cake. Um, it looks like there's obviously blackberries, some like chocolate ice cream, chocolate syrup, um, chocolate, and then there's obviously the cake, cacao nibs, and then that looks like macadamia nuts with like some some. <laughs> um, wow, yeah, I'm excited. So I'm gonna try to get a bite of everything. Well, I mean, we all know what blackberries taste like. Wow. I like can't get everything. There's too much. There's too much. <laughs> Those are good. There's coconut somewhere. So I should probably eat them separately. Thank you. Those are amazing. I would eat those, like, they came in a little jar. I'd eat all of them. Now this ice cream. That's mousse. Well, I don't know if it's had mousse on the menu, but it tastes like mousse. What is a black mousse? Fresh. Is it the cake? He's like, there's no that somewhere in there. It's not the cacao names. My bad. Really good, thank you. Well, those are really weird to count with. I just taste more bitter. Chocolate is happy. And that chocolate. Why does it taste like fruit? I don't know. Anyway, should I be filming up here? Up here? Way out here? I'm gonna eat now. So, if you're in Santa Barbara and you want a quick snack, maybe go to Blenders in the Grass because they have plant based, dairy free stuff. <laughs> Dragon Wait. It's like one of those. I'll put it I'll put it in somewhere. But I got just extra blueberries on or banana on top instead of strawberries because strawberries, you know, you know. What? So this is it's a deep bowl. Oh look at that. Mm. So good. Look at these crystals. They have different crystals, like. Anyway, this is awesome. 
And I really want to check out Malibu Farm, like that cafe, so hopefully I don't get too hot. Okay, so I forgot that I've been here before, but I'm getting the heirloom Sweden watermelon, and everything with me is vegan. And then last time I was here, I got the teriyaki quinoa bowl with tofu, and it was super, super good, so I might get that again, depending on how hungry I am. So this is what it looks like. No idea how food tastes. So I got a bite of everything. So tomato, mint, yogurt, and watermelon. It's awesome. I don't really, I can't describe it. It just tastes like all of those things. The yogurt. It's a little bit more savory, which is like super complimentary to the watermelon. And um, yeah, I don't know how to review it. vegan and I ordered the soy sauce noodles and the sweet and sour tofu with brown rice. I'm feeling like very like salty. I've had a lot of sweet things and I'm normally like such a salty craver and so I'm just like let me get back to my natural state um, and hopefully it's a lot of food so I can take it back to my hotel room and like chill and feel comfortable knowing I have food. Hey you guys, the music in this clip was really loud so I'm doing a voiceover. These are the soy sauce noodles. This is the brown rice. It also has red rice in it too. And this is the sweet and sour tofu. It has pineapple in it. And I got like all three of these hot sauces. They might have been the same hot sauce. Honestly, I don't know. I didn't really use them. Alright, so I don't even know where to start so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna pick up some tofu. No, you know I hate eating hot things. The soy sauce noodles are colder. That's amazing. Tastes like soy sauce. And now it's like really good. It has a really good flavor. It doesn't taste like just soy sauce. Okay, I can't find a vegetable that's um, not piping hot, so. That's also so good. I'm like stoked to try it with the pineapple. I should wait, but this is... <sighs> yeah, it's amazing. It's like hot and sour. Okay, so I just went to Earth Bar in Santa Monica. It's like right across from the boardwalk. I don't know if you can see it over there. But um, I got a Radiant Skin Smoothie. And I got it because it has papaya in it, which I'm obsessed with papaya. And I think that's it. <laughs> um, I'm gonna... Why did I say... Okay, I said that because I'm feeling really awkward right now. <laughs> okay, so I went to Earth Bar in Santa Monica. It's like right across from the pier. It's like over there. I'm walking to yoga. Um, this is a radiant skin smoothie. It has papaya, greens powder, acai, other good stuff, almond milk. Um, yum. Wow. It's really good. It's super creamy. Um, so I'm gonna go find my yoga studio and I'll catch you guys later. As a vegan or not, um, with a mixed green salad, and a 
Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I want to try to do the salad, but I can't substitute, so I'll just show you. Alright, food is here. So this is the Reuben. I'm so excited for the sauerkraut. I feel like I haven't had sauerkraut in forever and I love it. And there's the salad, which is like white dressing and I love that. I love it. 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 That's really good too. Mm -hmm. It doesn't taste like, like a traditional Caesar salad. It's a little bit more lemony. Hi, it's so sunny. So I walked from Santa Monica um, Beach slash boardwalk to Venice Beach, which is where I am now. Um, and I think what I want to do is go to an ice cream so I will take you all. bread can't remember but I'll show it to you and it's so pretty here like so gorgeous here is the bread and butter and then here is the soup so cute they poured it out for me the actual soup part It's like the best bread and butter I've ever had. Look how gorgeous it looks. I love the beans in it. It's super, super fresh and tastes really healthy. But also salty. And I like it.
LA vegan. Their menu is literally ginormous. I don't know, so I'm going to pick what I'm going to eat. Um, so we'll be able to work on this. Okay, so I decided I'm going to do a soy chicken crispy taco. It's going to be so random. I'm going to deluxe breakfast. I have like hash brown, sausage, bacon, cheese, 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 I just realized how much food I ordered because I thought I got one taco. Um, it's actually three, so wow. They're very spot on to real tacos, actually. Like the chicken is like very good imitation chicken. Um, I think it needs salsa. The cheese I use is really good too. Mm -hmm. Look at this deliciousness. Let me just show you what's under here. There's bacon. There's the tofu scramble down there. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. I need that. Bye. Before I like road trips. It's fun. It's amazing. Yeah. 